products. That is the conversation that they were having. And he was, when he was traveling with the people from Apple, and he said, hey, did you guys know that they're coming up with this gadget, um, which is going to be better than, than your Apple products? You know what they said? Oh, okay, could be, could be. Actually did not even pay attention. And this is what I mean by there is no competition. If you do what you love, and if you're able to add value to people through the products and services that you have, there will be no competition. Yes, there will be some people operating same space, but there's enough for everybody and your target market, your audience is all different. So there is no competition. So do not actually focus on competition. Avoid this mistake. Which can make you different, whether in a job or in business, it does not matter. Anybody would like to chime into this point? Just flash your mic so I can just pick any of you on this point. Competition versus collaboration. Okay. Am I stuck? Is my screen stuck? No. Okay, my screen is working. Okay, all right. Saju, you want to add something? Yes, Saju, go ahead, please. Sure. So, uh, this reminds me, Dave, of a very interesting uh, uh, problem uh, that was discussed uh, by a lot of consultants once. Uh, it's a very famous uh, issue called the elevator problem. And many times, uh, you know, uh, people would, would call up this company which manufactured elevators and would tell them that your elevator is too slow, right? And it was given to, uh, you know, uh, their engineering department saying, hey, we're getting a lot of customer feedback saying elevator is too slow. Right, so uh, automatically, you know, everybody was busy. Like, okay, how do we, you know, increase the speed of the of the elevator? We need a faster motor. We need new software. Uh, try to see if we can get more efficiency. Change the material on which the, the the pulleys were working, and so on and so forth. Until somebody really actually focused on getting to understand what was this slow elevator problem all about. Uh, repeatedly and he found that what people were 